it. This is Miranda from My Scrappy Life, and I'm back on the Shimmers Design Team YouTube channel. And remember, if you put my name in the comments, you will get a freebie that is a surprise, and it's a little mini one. So, I am going to use a ton of products today, and I wanted to create or recreate a mixed media paper that I found in, excuse me, that I found in... Um, the Vicky Boot and watercolor thing because I am in my Cuba book and I wanted to use all of Vicky Booten style um, Let's Wander collection and um, the one with the Honeybee collection. I can't remember what that one's called. But she had one where she had just three lines. I decided to do four lines. And the very first yellow that you were that you saw me put down was colorings, no yokings. And then this yellow is the colorings little um, yellow school bus. And then I'm coming in with pop art pink, and that's a vibes. And it does get a little bit darker here. And I'm using the glaze that you're seeing is putting on the glitz, and that's from Dazzles. And then the very last one that I'm going to come in with after cleaning up is Mango Tango. And then, of course, you'll see what more I do to this layout. But I think it really turns out wonderful. I add a little bit more mixed media to this than what was on the original page. This is actually, if I would have stopped right here, this is what it was. But I wanted to take it one step further and I have this um, star cut file that I turned in to a stencil that's a 12 by 12 stencil um, that was made out of acetate. I had my um, Cricut cut it for me. And this glaze that I'm using here is textured whitey tidy. Now this is white but it's got texture stuff in it. It's got like the sand. And I'm just going through it all, and if it's a little, if the stars are a little messy, it doesn't bother me. Um, I just wanted to make sure that I got on as much as I possibly wanted, but still kind of light enough throughout all this. So I kind of wipe off everything and then pull it off. And here is slow-mo of the four colors I picked. And you can see the putting on the glitz comes through, the whitey tighties there, and then the four color tones. I don't mind that it's a little bit uh, water-based, and that's exactly what it was. So, now the photo. The photo is, while we were in Cuba, I went on a excursion just myself with obviously a bunch of other um, boat uh, people that came on the cruise, but um, Josh stayed back this time. He didn't want to do this excursion. And um, there is a, in Cuba, in Havana, I should say, there is one street that is wood. And they've kept it wood this whole entire time. And that's what I'm standing on. And the history behind it is one of the mayors or governors or something to that effect. Um, I can't quite remember what the, the host did, the tour guide told us. But um, essentially, the wife was taking taking naps, and back when horse and buggy would go across the cobblestones, it made her mad because it would always wake her up during her afternoon nap. So she made, or he made all of at that time, like the servants or um, you know the the servants and stuff that was working for them. Um, did the wooden, like this wooden road right outside this area. And that is what I'm standing on. However, I'm taking this photograph and I'm turning it into more of a girly girl type collection. So I decided to pull the yellow to the bottom and the mint because my shoes match that color. So you can't quite tell in the photograph, but I have the same type of converse that Vicki Booten did in her, um, you know, like in her stickers and then that big, like the big embellishment that it has. I have the same style. 
except my stick or my um, converse are more ombre effect. So it's more white in the front and then the teal shows up. Either way, they're still teal. Those work. And when I saw the simple things as a title, I was like, that is perfect. And then this yellow tone is what made me decide I'm going to do yellow on the bottom where the, the pinkish colors and the orangey colors are and then put that teal color on top. And it's a semi, it's kind of like a monochromatic, um, like an oxymoron style of a layout. But once you see how it turns out, it is it is amazing. I just love it. Obviously, you guys know that the still shots are going to be at the end. Make sure that you like and subscribe to the Shimmers Pate um, YouTube channel. Everything will be linked down below of all of the products that I used. I will say them one more time just so that you guys know because I did use quite a bit. So, the two orangey colors, the pinkish orangey colors that I used were Vibes and that is Pop Art Pink and Mango Tango. Um, the two colorings that I use, which is the yellow tones that you see, are colorings, no yoking, little yellow school bus. The textures, which is the stars, are whitey tidy, and I use um, Dazzle's putting on the glitz to spread it out, as you can see there. So I decided to go and get some thread and put it behind the other sticker that's kind of like my title within the title right there. And it says, um, my life is a grand adventure, and it certainly is, with um, how things are, and the way things are, and how we have to travel all over God's green earth for my husband's job, and all that. It's pretty much a grand adventure. I never know when we're going to stop, or whatever the case may be. So... I did use all these products that you're seeing me using now outside of the Shimmers Paints is Vicki Mooten's last few um, collections that she came out with. Like this uh, one here, the, what, the title that I'm using, I'm not quite sure which ones that was from. And also I'm adding all these butterflies because if you don't follow me over on my personal channel, that'll be linked down below. However... In my personal channel, when I was talking about this particular collection and this storyline of me going to Cuba on our anniversary trip with my, you know, with my husband Josh, we I wanted to add butterflies to every layout, and um, so I added these, and then I'm just coming in. So there's like Let's Wander. It's this one here. Um, it's like the honeycomb one. You'll see me come out with some bees and all that. And then I found these tassels. Now look how these tassels just bring this whole layout like together. It is like, that's like made it all. I just love how it turns out. It's just perfect. So you'll see me put these up on some foam tape and then that's it. I place these down and I come back in with the vibes. And my gold that I love to use for vibes is um, Sunset Strip. It's like just that perfect color that's not quite like gold gold. And it's like a bronzy yellowish sunset type of color. And that's why I like it. It's more yellow based than like gold based. But it's still gold. Then I come in with these little hearts that are circles and I just kind of place them wherever I think they work. And then I come in with these honeybees and kind of put them around. And then that's pretty much it. You'll see me use some um, splatters, do some still shots here at the end. Make sure that you like and subscribe to the channel. Check everything down below, the colors, the um, links. Make sure that you remember to put my name in the comments to get your little freebie. And I hope that you guys are all staying safe. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I will talk to you soon. Bye!